Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Rodney, and I'm back. And I just wanted to come in and run my mouth and talk about some people. Um, when is Kenya's? Uh, I may go live next week. I think because Kenya's uh, part two of the interview with Carlos King, it premieres, I think, next week sometime. Um, de depending on the day. Um, that's going to determine whether I whether or not I decide to go live. That my contact, I think my contact is bothering me. I need to take it out. Um, so yeah, I'm thinking about going live for Kenya's uh, part two of the interview. Oh, I gotta pop my fingers. Hold up. With Carlos King. Anyways, let's go ahead and get it. I should have took this contact out because it's bothering me. We're gonna be all right. We gonna be all right with y'all. All right. So listen, let's go ahead and get into this mess. Um, you know who I want to start out with? I want to start out with Thor. Is that how you pronounce his name? Like Thor? Oh gosh! Shout out to Thor. Um, but Thor, he—I don't know anything about this man. I know he was on Black Ink Crew. I don't know which one. Um. The only person I really keep up with uh, when it comes to Black Ink Crew is Ryan with his trifling self. Didn't he sleep with his best friend's baby mama? Mm. <laughs> Ain't he trash? Ugh, it's always the fine ones. Um, shout out to Ryan. Um, I need a tattoo. <laughs> hey! I need a tattoo, Mr. Ryan. I want to get a cover up for this right here. On my hand, I want to get a cover up, and I want it to kind of go down to my wrist. So I want this part covered up, and I want it to come down. That's what I want. Yeah. Um, so, um, four has in uh, has a OF page, and um, he's into a lot of what some people would say, like I guess kinky stuff. Um, they say that he has one video of him eat, uh, <laughs> of him uh, munching girl on some boonchy cat, and the lady was on her cycle. So he, you know, girl, clearly he like his meat, girl, rare. You know, <laughs> shout out to the girl, <laughs> shout out to y'all who like y'all meat with a little bit of blood in it. That's not how I roll. Um, you know, Boonchi Cat really not my ministry anyways. Um, so basically, he was out here girl, munching on some Boonchi Cat, allegedly, and the lady was on her cycle. And then there was another um, a photo that got out of him being in a cage. Um, and then also, the latest thing that I heard was he um, is attracted to trans women. Um, and so some people have had a lot to say about him and I guess the things that he's into. Um, and so he was doing an interview, uh, and this is what he had to say when they were talking about his son. So this is according to the neighborhood talk Four says his sexual social media history won't affect his son in the, in the future because he will be. Uh, in a different caliber than everyone else's kids. Do you hear Kim K and her kids talk about, mm -mm, hold up, y'all, I got to take this contact out. It's a wrap. Hold up. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Sorry. I, I know it's a glare. I know it's a glare, um, but I had to take those contacts out. Well, that contact, because it was girl. Those who wear contacts, um, when your contacts go bad, I say go bad, when they expire, and they're in your eyeball. Does your eye start to like burn? Because <laughs> that's what happens. That's what I. That's what I assume. The contact. The contact is. <laughs> girl, you can't use it no more. Girl, it feel like the devil. It's just like dancing on your eyeball, girl. It's the girl. It's hard. I was about to say it's the worst feeling. Girl, it's one of the worst feelings, girl. It just. It just start burning, and your eyes start running. I was trying to push it through to the end of this video, but I wasn't gonna make it. Ooh, girl. All right. And I, I wasn't about to put any more contacts in. So if the glare is bothering you, um, then just pretend you're listening to the radio. <laughs> girl, close your eyes and listen to my voice. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and get back into this mess. Okay, y'all. Um, let me make sure this microphone is on. Okay, it's on. All right. So, um, four. This is what he had to say. Um, uh, this is according to the, the neighborhood talk. Y'all agree? Four says his sexual social media history won't affect his son in the future because he will be in a different caliber than everyone else's kids. Do you hear Kim K and her kids talk about her and Ray J's tape? So I'm going to play the audio, but I'm also going to read the comments because of course, you know, I'd be in the comment section. If you want to, if you want to find me, girl, go look in the comment section. You will always find me. Okay. Um, cause like a lot of other people, I have something to say too. Um, Again, I don't keep up with four. I don't know nothing about this man. Um, this is the most that I've ever heard about him. This is the most I've ever seen him in the blogs. When, since it got out, I guess he had an OnlyFans. And he was doing things that I guess were, to some people, out of the ordinary for them. Girl, quiet as this kill. <laughs> if we want to be honest about it, girl. Boy, ain't the only one around her eating, girl, eating me, girl, eating rare, eating rare boochie cat. Right? Girl, y'all know some of y'all, because I done had to get onto a couple of girls that I know. Girl, now they not necessarily doing it, but somebody doing it to them. I'm like, mm, y'all nasty. Girl, it is what it is. But boy, ain't the only one out here, girl, you know, having sex while a, while a woman is on, on their period. Because I'm sure that you, girl. Know somebody or you done done it too. Okay. Uh anyways, let's go ahead and play the audio of four talking, okay? <clears throat> Your son's gonna see this one day. Right? Yeah, I was gonna I, ask I, so, you that. So, so I sit up here and think about this, right? That's how I look at it. For one, my son is two in five to ten years, none of this shit's gonna fucking matter, right? right? Because I got X Y, I got so many things that I'm putting on top of this. They're going to tell you everything. I have a great, hey, son, I, your, your father lived his fucking life, right? Mm -hmm. I did X, Y, and Z to make sure you're straight, right? So I look at it like this. Do you hear Kim K kids talk about her and fucking Ray J tape? You really? Know I mean? No, right. So, right. No one gives a fuck because it's fucking, right. she got so much shit going on. She's, you got to think about this. My child is not where your, your child is going to be. You know what I'm saying? Right. My child is going to be somewhere <laughs> tucked off around certain, certain amount of caliber, caliber, you know? Yeah. So it's like, and even if it, even, and so I think like that, even if my son ever, even it's even if, right, I'm going to tell him before anybody else does. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, son, I did X, Y, and Z. You know what I'm saying? This is this is that, this is that. But my, my, my most importantly, my goal will be with my son is to be yourself. You don't have to be nothing like me, but be yourself. You don't feel like And be comfortable being yourself. That's what I'm right. See, I, I was that kid that wasn't. So. Okay. So. This is what I had to say in the comment section. <clears throat> Y'all ready? <laughs> Let's call a thing a thing. Y'all don't care about him having OnlyFans or him being put in a cage. Y'all are outraged because they say he's getting pegged and he sleeps with trans women. So here comes the what about your kids crew? What about your kids? Asking for myself. So this is what somebody responded and said to me. They don't care about, no, I'm sorry. This is what somebody said, re responded to me. So when Mimi, a reality star, was swinging on shower rides, nobody ever said, what about Eva? Yeah, the F they did. It's always about their kids. It has nothing to do with him being gay. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't say he was gay. That's y'all. Y'all think, but let me shut up. Um, y'all community want everything to evolve around who y'all decide to freak and tell the whole world about it. Give it a break. And then someone else also said, I disagree. So many people like Suki, Mimi, Kim K, etc. have did porn and people always bring up their kids. Everything and always about LGBTQ stuff. It can always be about it can always be about what their kids got to see and how their kids get picked on in the long run. And then somebody responded to them, to, to them and said, shout out to Paige Purr. Why would any of you assume their kids will be picked on? And if their kids do see it, do you think he won't be able to talk to his kids about it? 
or do you think their kids will stop loving them or something? And everyone, and, and everyone, wait, and every kid isn't going to take being picked on. Let's be free. That's another thing, too. Let's just say that Kim, K, and Four Son, they are picked on by some of your children. Some, what, what you need to also realize is that some of your kids may get their ass whooped. Because everybody's not going to take being picked on or bullied because your kids want to or don't like something that their parents did. So when your kids decide to bully somebody and they come home and they're missing a tooth, or girl, a ponytail is missing, girl, or they got a black eye, just know it was probably well-deserved. Sorry. That's what, bullies, that's what bullies get sometimes. Sometimes the bullies get their ass whooped, okay? So this is what I had to say in response to one of the comments. It's always the women who get the backlash, not the men. You just named the women as if the men, as, as if they, wait, I'm sorry. You just named the women as if the men, girl, what did I put? You just named the women as, oh, I'm sorry. I miss, I, 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 I didn't uh, write the sentence right. So this is what I put. It's always the women who get the backlash. You just named the women as if the men didn't do the sex tapes. And the, like the men who do the sex tapes don't have kids. Y'all don't care about men having sex tapes. The backlash is always for the women and their kids. So I don't believe y'all give a damn about this man having an OnlyFans. So this is a point that I want to make before we, go, before we go any further. Anytime you hear about a sex tape, the woman gets the backlash. Just listen to me. The woman gets the backlash. Whether it's Kim K, whether it's Paris Hilton, whether it's Mimi, or uh, whatever, uh, what, whomever else it may be. You never hear people say, Ray J, what about your kids? You never heard people say, Stevie J, what about... Stevie J was just on the internet doing an interview and was getting his... In an interview, I didn't hear people talking about, what about Eva? What's his name? Uh, Angela White's baby daddy. Tiger, Tigger. He got her OnlyFans. Safari, girl, penis floating all around the internet. And a, a ledge, uh, an alleged sex tape, girl, right? Uh, uh, it was leaked, girl. Him having sex with some woman. Of like, what, a, a few months ago. So the point I'm trying to make is there's never outrage over when a man has does a sex tape. The outrage only comes or the backlash is only directed to the woman. The men never receive the backlash. So now all of a sudden you have another man who has an OnlyFans and is having sex. And now here come the what about your kids? No. What it is, is girl, y'all don't like the fact that four is getting fucked. Y'all don't like the fact that four isn't to trans women. Because if four was just having sex with a real woman, there would be no backlash. It would be no what about your kids. It wouldn't. It wouldn't. Y'all are using the kids to cover up your transphobia. Period. Okay? Full stop. That's all it comes down to. Because as some of the comments say, y'all gay people, y'all you gay, y'all community. Four ain't never said he was gay. Four says he's into women. You might not like the type of woman that he's into, but four ain't into niggas like me. I think that what four is doing makes people uncomfortable, especially if they don't move or participate or do or have sex the way that four likes to maybe have sex. And then when you start to throw in him getting pegged and trans women, oh my God, what about your kids? Because again, I don't see nobody. Yeah, y'all talk about Kim K. Even four brought up Kim K. But what he should have said was, Ain't nobody going to care about that. Y'all don't care about Ray J. 
<laughs> y'all don't care about CBJ. Y'all don't care about Safari. Y'all don't care about uh, Angela White's baby daddy. So why would y'all care about me? Oh, I know why y'all care about me. Y'all care about me because, girl, I have sex with trans women and because I'm getting pegged. It has nothing to do with my son. It has nothing to do with me having an OnlyFans page. You're only outraged because of what I'm doing and who I'm doing it with. So let me read some comments. Let's go back to the comment section. This is what someone had to say. Someone said, but you proved his point. You only named women, never the man. If four was having sex with the typical, having sex the typical regular way, y'all would not be worried about his kids. Y'all are only concerned now because of the type of sex this man is having. It's not about the OnlyFans, nor is it about his kids finding out, finding his OnlyFans. The concern is his son seeing him getting pegged. There we go. That's all it is. Tigger got on OnlyFans too, Safari too, and so many other men. They never get backlash because of the type of sex they are having. That's the point. There we go. They never get backlash because y'all don't see nothing wrong with Safari having sex with a real woman. The backlash is because of what Four is doing and who he's doing it with. That's, that's why y'all are bothered. Not y'all, but y'all. Shout out to Erica DeNero TV. Not y'all, but y'all. This is another comment uh, this person left. I'm saying the people you named was, all, was only women. He was, he was referring to the person who was talking about Mimi, Eva. I mean, Mimi um, and the other women I named. You never not once mention the men because usually y'all don't give two Fs about men having an OnlyFans because many of these celebrity males do and they never get questioned about it. The reason this man is getting backlash is because of the type of sex he decided. I'm sorry. Um, because of the type of sex he decided to broadcast. That is because one, wait, that is because one have to question if all these other men have kids who have an OF is never questioned. Their kids are never brought up. You have to ask, what's the difference here? Oh, because of the type of sex this man is having. And no matter how much y'all say y'all don't give a F, y'all actually say something different. It's, it's, not a day, it's not a day that goes by without y'all calling something gay, calling something sassy, this gay, that's gay, it's gay, etc. Heterosexuals talk about gay shit and something being, and some, and something being gay more than anybody. Y'all whole world view is surrounded and immersed in anything gay. Um, for now, wait. For now on, from now on, you really listen to the conversations you have. For now, wait. I don't know what they put. You have to wait. Basically, for now, I'm thinking they put men from uh, from from. From now on, you really listen to the conversations you have, and that and that is being had around you. Not a day goes by without gay being mentioned. And then someone, shout out to Paige Purr. Um, they put, they don't care about anyone's kids. They just using kids as a shield. I don't know why adults want to see his kids bullies based off what, bully based off what he does. That's so weird. It's a childish mentality to have. But most people are very childish when it comes to talking about sex. Only bad parents want to see other kids bullied. I said on what I said. I don't think y'all care about four. Having an OnlyFans is basically what he's doing. Y'all don't care about y'all. Y'all don't y'all like I hate I, when I say y'all. I'm not talking about y'all. Y'all, but not y'all. But people don't people don't care about kids, girl. <laughs> y'all people pick and choose the kids that care about the LGBTQ kids, girl. Y'all throw under girl. Y'all throw girl off the mountain. The ones who y'all think are straight, girl, it's protect, protect, protect. Y'all can't say y'all care about kids. So like I always say, girl, they could post something about Zaya Wade tomorrow, and girl, y'all gonna wear a little Zaya out. But then y'all turn around and say, we, 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 we not supposed to talk about kids. I can't tell. 
But back to back to four. I just don't. I believe. I believe that's what. I believe that's what it is. I believe y'all are trying to. Y'all are using four son to make it seem as though you care about the well being of his son or his son potentially getting picked on when well, that's not the case. You just you need to find you need to find something to disguise your transphobia. You need to find something to disguise because you think that he's gay, your homophobe, your homophobia. That's all it comes down to. Until y'all start being outraged about these other niggas having sex on camera, I don't believe it. Because just like the person mentioned the people, they didn't mention not one man. Every person was a woman. But you want me to believe that you care about these men having sex on camera when you don't? Because when Safari's big dick was swinging around the internet, I didn't hear nobody mention his future kids or his kids. Everybody was running to go see, girl, let me go see this piece. That's what I think is going on. Shout out to Four. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm not into the stuff four is into, but I also can recognize bullshit and I can also smell bullshit. My nostrils work very well. And my eyes, when my contacts ain't bothering me, when I got these glasses on, bitch, I can see, I can spot bullshit. I can spot a lie from a mile away. Anyways, that's it. <laughs> that's all I had to say. Stop using, stop trying to use that man's son to cover up your transphobia. Stop trying to use that man's son to cover up your homophobia because y'all don't care about that man having sex online. Y'all just y'all y'all care because y'all think his son is gonna be embarrassed because if he looks up one day and sees a video of his daddy getting fucked. Because if it, if four is out here having sex with a big booty, a big booty girl, girl, real woman, girl, it won't be no outrage. Cause too many of these men, too girl, damn near everybody from VH1, girl, got an OnlyFans page. Girl, I ain't seen y'all. I ain't seen no outrage from no, about, about none of them. Girl, Stevie J sitting in the interview. Girl, getting his whole dick sucked, and I ain't heard y'all mention nothing about Lil Eva. And before that, Stevie J supposedly had a sex tape floating around with uh with Eve. Hello. <laughs> and I ain't heard y'all mention none of the kids before Eva. <laughs> anyway, y'all go. I'll talk to y'all later. Have a good day. Bye, y'all.